y'all. Welcome to my channel. This is Miss Mother Trucker coming at you from Texas. Um, anyway, I'm going to go over a revenue for a week. Okay, we started out going to um, Washington to Florida. That was for 6,195 miles. No, dollars. Sorry, it was the revenue for it. The total miles were $3,203. And then from there, we got a load coming out of Florida, from Florida back, to, from Florida to California. That revenue was $3,470. And the total miles on that was, um, 2,578 miles. And the reason that there's that disparity, anytime you're going into Florida, make sure the load you have is worth it because coming out of Florida, revenue is going to suck. And um, then we had a uh, Washington to Washington load. Actually, that was our first load. I just wrote it down backwards and then we got the Washington to Florida load. That load was for $2,108, and it was only 680 miles. So that was my week, y'all. And I'm sorry, that this, I know this is a little bouncy on y'all. It's just the roads we're on, and we're headed down the road. But, you know, this market is fluctuating a lot, but I am actually being kept really busy. Today is uh, Friday, and I'm already on my second load for the week, so it's actually not going too bad. And I've been hearing a lot about nothing about these inward-facing cameras and all these what-ifs. What if this happens? What if that happens? I'm quitting. I'm sorry, y'all. There is no way I am throwing away this kind of job. I call it a job even though I am, am a contractor with Prime, but I and a truck owner. I'm purchasing my truck, but it's still a job. Um, do I like the idea that we're facing cameras? No. Do I think that as far as lawsuits, I think they're going to come back to like the company. But I don't know, Brian. Rob Lowe does. And it ultimately comes down to his final decision. Um, and I just don't see it as that big of a deal, and I went and checked them out. They're just not that big of a deal. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to do this quick little video, upload it, and um, just give you a week's worth of revenue, what I'm doing right now. My take home on that was around 3200 not the best, but I am an instructor. Should my revenue be much higher as an instructor? Yes. And the thing is, if you have that tipping point, so my percentage of what I would have taken home would have been more, but first I had to pay my student, I had to pay my truck payment. If I had got another load in that week, that would have way shot up my revenue because that would have almost all been profit outside of the fuel. So, you know, it is what it is. Um, I see things are starting to pick up. I'm really excited about that. And I'm sorry, y'all. I know I keep looking off because I'm just not used to having the camera up there. But as you see, now we're starting to bounce some because I'm not holding the camera. So anyway, guys, I hope everyone's doing well. Um, I'm really grateful for each and every one of you, all my truckers and truckerettes out there on Trucker Nation. See, that's what I'm going to start saying pick that up from old slime pack nation but I'm trucker and trucker trucker and trucker at nation this is my nation but anyway guys um I hope everyone's doing good looking forward to doing a live and talking to y'all and I'll try to get a live out within the next couple days I do one right now except for we're moving and you know the internet's just too spotty to do that okay guys y'all take care until next time, all my truckers and trucker lights, keep your shiny side up. Keep the rubber on the road. Please treat each other with kindness and respect. Okay, lots of love. Bye-bye.